Wake up and start your day now on ITV1 with the team on Good Morning Britain. Good morning, Good morning, Britain. Fury from families who lost mm. loved ones in the early days of the pandemic. After shocking revelations at the COVID inquiry, Boris Johnson suggested the virus was, and I quote, nature's way of dealing with old people, according to diary entries written by the UK's then top scientific advisor. The language that's being used is, is unbelievable. It's disrespectful, it's callous. And perhaps if there had been more humanity at the top, lives would have been saved. Meanwhile, at least 50 people are killed after an Israeli airstrike on a Gaza refugee camp. There are reports this morning that Egypt is preparing to receive wounded Palestinians for medical treatment. Flying into a rage at work, Alec Gordon Ramsay could be the key to success. Didn't do him any harm, did it? And this is according to a new study. Do you think bosses need to lose their rag to get the job done? We're debating that later. She is a soul superstar. Macy Gray joining us live as she reveals why she's had the last laugh on school bullies. The bullies who made fun of, guess what? Her voice. Wet weather this week has already caused scenes of flooding and there is more wet weather as Storm Kieran arrives overnight tonight, bringing with it torrential rain and strong winds, which is set to lead to widespread disruption in the south. I'll have all the details of that and more coming up on Good Morning Britain. Wednesday, 1st of November, 2023. Live from Television Centre in London, this is Good Morning Britain with Kate Garraway and Richard Maidley. Morning. And yes. we should say we'll be going live okay. to Kenya. We um, will be, absolutely. About quarter, about roughly about quarter to eight. Yes, yeah, somewhere yeah. around there, uh, the, the, the king and queen who we saw yesterday started their...